Hello and welcome to Defect of the Month. My name's Bob Willis. And what I wanted to talk about briefly, or perhaps demonstrate, is a method of doing solderability testing on components. It's what we call a process simulation test. It's also covered generally in the IPC standards. What you need to do is take your stencil that you're using in manufacture, your solder paste that you're using, and also some small glass slides. Now what you do is print the solder paste you're using in manufacture onto the glass slides with your stencil. So this simulates the way in which you're using the package that perhaps is a concern to you. You then place the component into the solder paste on the glass slide, as you would do with your pick and place machine on a real board, and then you run it through your reflow soldering process. Remember this is a process simulation of what you're doing to demonstrate whether it's a component issue or something else in manufacture. Now when the glass slides come out of your reflow process, what should have happened is all of the solder paste should have reflowed and should have wetted the termination, literally wicked up the termination because it won't wet to the solder and there should be no real evidence of solder left on the surface of the glass, only flux perhaps holding the component in place. Now you can use this test for a variety of different components and it is in fact the only way of really checking BGA packages. But here I've illustrated it with other surface mount parts.